News Army. North Korea is thought to have fired a ballistic missile into the sea. According to South Korean military authorities, North Korea is believed to have launched a ballistic missile off its east coast, marking its first known test since June. It occurred after a U.S. aircraft carrier landed in South Korea to engage in joint exercises and before Vice President Kamala Harris's scheduled visit. State-run media in South Korea said its neighbor might be planning to test a submarine-launched ballistic missile. The United Nations forbids North Korea from testing ballistic and nuclear weapons. Japan's Coast Guard verified the launch and issued ships a be alert warning. The company said the item looked to have landed outside its exclusive economic zone. The nuclear-powered USS Ronald Reagan arrived in the southern port city of Busan on Friday to participate in joint exercises off the coast of South Korea's eastern coast. According to the South Korean Navy, the drills are intended to promote peace and stability on the Korean peninsula. In the following days, Ms. Harris will visit South Korea as part of a regional journey that will include the burial of former Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe. In the last year, Pyongyang has launched several ballistic missiles, escalating tensions on the Korean peninsula. President Yoon Suk-yeol of South Korea, who took office in May, has pledged to take a stronger stance against North Korea and to strengthen relations with the United States.